Hello friends, Adam Smith here from RussianPo.com. Today we'll be covering a lesson number 31 by Anna Akhmatova. It's a Russian poem. I'll read it in Russian. Then I'll read the translation line by line into English. Like, share, subscribe, donate. Every action is appreciated. There are links below for all of the sections. And uh, let's get started. Именится голос человека, здесь никогда не прозвучит. Лишь ветер каменного века в ворота черные стучит. Именится мне, что уцелела, под этим небом я одна. За то, что первая хотела испить смертельного вина. Well, basically, poem speaks about uh, how lonely it is and how she is the only one who survived because she tried to drink a deadly wine. I don't know what it means, but uh, let's get to the translation. And uh, I hope we will figure it out. Имнится голос человека. And it seems the voice of man. Здесь никогда не прозвучит. Here will never sound. Лишь ветер каменного века. Only the wind of the stone age. Ворота черные стучит. Knocks at the black gates. Имнится мне, что уцелел. And it seems to me that survived. Под этим небом я одна. Under the sky I'm alone. За то, что первое хотела, for what that I first wanted, испить смертельного вина, to drink of deadly wine. As I said, deadly wine, and uh, I have no idea what it speaks about when it says I wanted, uh, the, I was the first one who wanted to drink of a deadly wine. Uh, maybe it's like a metaphor, like... Adam and Eve, when they to uh, they did took the forbidden fruit, they were banished from heaven. So maybe here she says like she tried to drink a deadly wine, and she was the one, the only one who survived on beneath the sky. Maybe it's something like that, because you know poets and prosaics, prose writers, they like to put metaphors and some sacred or secret ideas behind their words, their words. So I believe it's something like that. Anyway, thank you for listening and have a great day. For a text version, simply go to RussianPo.com. It's uh, Poem 31 by Anna Akhmatova. And uh, see, see you in the next lessons. Thank you very much.